गुड मॉर्निंग ग्रेड नाइन हाउ आर यू ऑल वेलकम टू द बायोलॉजी क्लास लेक्चर सेवन टूडे वी विल डिस्कस अबाउट ब्रीथिंग मूवमेंट वॉट आर ब्रीथिंग मूवमेंट्स या दे आर ऑल्सो कॉल्ड एज वेंटिलेशन इट्स द मूवमेंट ऑफ एयर थ्रू द कंडक्टिंग पैसेजेस बिटवीन द एटमोसफेयर एंड द लंग्स वेन वी इनहेल एंड वेन वी एक्जेल वॉट इज इनहेल वेन वी ब्रीथ इन okay when the process of air flowing into the lungs during inspiration inhalation and out of the lungs during expiration that is exhalation is called as breathing or called as pulmonary ventilation the word pulmonary i told you before also we always use when we are talking about lungs okay so can you see this inhale is breathing in shown with the help of an arrow and exhale is breathing out but how do we or our body know whether to inhale or exhale yes one thing is because of our brain but how our brain gets the message how does it get to know finds this that it's the time to inhale or it's the time to exhale Do you remember diffusion? What we studied in diffusion is movement of molecules from region of higher concentration to the lower concentration, right? Similarly, air like other gases like in diffusion in our body also the air moves from a region with higher pressure to the region with lower pressure. so basically there are three different types of at pressures that is atmospheric pressure intra alveolar pressure and intra pleural pressure atmospheric pressure is the pressure of the air outside the body means about we are talking about atmosphere outside right intra alveolar pressure is the pressure inside the alveoli of the lungs as its name represent and intra pleural again its name represent is the pressure within the pleural cavity so these three pressures are responsible for pulmonary ventilation now let's see what happens in inspiration and expiration let me tell you what is inspiration inspiration is the another word used for breathing in that is inhalation and expiration is another word uh for breathing out or exhalation so we use three words for each uh, both of these things inspiration inhalation breathing in same thing expiration exhalation and breathing out is same the picture on the left shows inspiration that is breathing in during which the rib cage moves up and out you can even try this by Uh, in your own body also by breathing in just inhale the air inside and see what do you feel do you feel your chest moving outside yeah and at that time your diaphragm contracts and moves down while on the right side that shows expiration the rib cage moves down and in and the diaphragm relaxes so what is inspiration it's an inhalation the process of taking air into the lungs and expiration is the process of letting air out of the lungs during breathing cycle okay so let's watch a short video that shows the breathing movement to make it more clear breathing movements inspiration the pressure in the lungs is decreased and the air rushes in the muscles of the diaphragm contract to make it descend the rib cage moves upwards and outwards expiration the pressure in lungs is increased and the air is pushed out the diaphragm becomes dome shaped relaxes and moves up simultaneously the rib cage moves down and in